It was a crisp autumn evening in 1994 when young Jonathan Reed's life took an unexpected turn. Driving home from a late-night gathering, a terrible car accident left him in a coma, fighting for his life. Time seemed to stand still for him while the world around him carried on. After what felt like an eternity, Jonathan's eyes fluttered open. But the face he saw in the mirror was that of an old man, weathered by time. Confusion overwhelmed him as he realized that decades had passed during his unconscious state. The world he knew had vanished, replaced by a strange and unfamiliar one. Seeking familiarity and solace, Jonathan reached out to his family, only to discover the heart-wrenching truth. All his relatives had passed away, leaving him utterly alone in this unfamiliar era. The weight of grief and loneliness bore down upon him. News of Jonathan's miraculous awakening spread like wildfire. The media latched onto his extraordinary tale, broadcasting his story and capturing the attention of millions. An interview with Jonathan was scheduled, promising to reveal his remarkable journey from the past to the present. As the media attention subsided, Jonathan began to grasp the enormity of the changes that had reshaped the world. Technology had become an all-encompassing force, and people were consumed by their digital lives. The world he awakened to was dominated by screens and virtual connections, leaving little room for genuine human interaction. Determined to rebuild his life, Jonathan ventured into this new digital realm. However, his efforts to make friends were met with indifference. People were too engrossed in their own virtual worlds to notice him or offer genuine connection. Loneliness started to suffocate him, driving him deeper into despair. Days turned into weeks, and Jonathan's isolation deepened. He found himself sinking into a profound depression, the weight of his solitude too heavy to bear. The absence of human warmth and connection left him feeling adrift in a world that no longer seemed to have a place for him. Less than a year after his return to life, Jonathan made a devastating decision. Overwhelmed by his loneliness and the bleakness of his existence, he succumbed to his despair and chose to take his own life. In the aftermath of Jonathan's death, the media returned, eager to follow up on the story they had dubbed, The Resurrection. But instead, they were met with the haunting realization of his untimely demise. The world was momentarily shaken, reflecting on the tragedy and the fragility of human connection. As time passed, people retreated back into the digital lives that had consumed them. The tragedy of Jonathan's story soon faded from public memory, replaced once again by the allure of screens and virtual realities. The world continued to move forward, but the loss of one man's desperate search for connection remained a poignant reminder of the dangers of isolation in an ever-connected world.